hi guys so i've got the starlink app and i'm going to show you how you can actually site and uh, position your 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 dish go to the app and um, once it opens up so you see here my starlink is the dish is active and i've got about four hours to go before it uh, finishes collecting data on obstructions and all now uh, if you click here on uh, gathering obstruction data you can actually check for obstructions it's going to tell you so all you need to do is just say i'm ready if you look you'll see those uh, dots that i think is checking the signal and all that stuff so i'll click on i'm ready and uh, here we go so you can see the trees the structures and all what you want to do is aim it at the sky you just check out it gathers all the data checks the positioning here where the trees are there's no signal uh, tells you where to go looking then you can check view results so as you can see here there are quite a number where i live there are quite a number of trees all around the place quite a number of trees all the way up to there so there's quite a number of trees really anyways let me view the results uh, the first time you're checking it's going to take a bit of time uh, so while I'm talking, so far, how do, am I finding the Starlink? I haven't yet connected to the internet. Yeah, it's still doing its calibration and checking and all that stuff. So possibly when it's done in four hours time, I'll, I should be able to get my connection set up and then I can advise. So here it's going to show you on the east worldly side, there's this bit of few uh, obstructions. Uh, the southern side, that's where the trees are quite a bit and the western side as well so the this is how the starlink is positioned the back is northward the front is uh, southward facing east and west side uh, uh, there's, there's a bit of uh, of that so anyway, let me just move to another location then i can try you see how it looks in a different spot i've just moved a few meters forward and i'm going to say try new location and uh, here we go so it's saying point your camera and yeah, you can see the dots. Uh, it's basically checking uh, obstructions and signal uh, strength and all that stuff. And there we go. Uh, when we view when we view results, yeah, it's going to be faster. And uh, here you see that there are more obstructions at this spot that I've found. Uh, on, but the southward part is clear. Then on the westward side, it's uh, it's also a little bit of obstructed. So I'm going to come a little bit of a different uh, location. Uh, facing, let me face north. Or let me face east. So I'll try now. Okay, so east, you see there's not much. It's, I'm moving north. There's no signal there. I'm moving west. There's no signal there, just some trees. And here you can see this is where the signal is going to be. There's a bit of a blockage and obstructions. And uh, let's view the results. So this one is going to be very, very bad results, I'm sure. And as you can see here, there's so much obstruction from the trees and all the nature and stuff. So I'm moving somewhere where there's a little bit... Uh, less obstruction uh, just some chicken runs and open uh, space this is maybe 30 to 50 meters away from where i was so here try a new location and uh, here you can see there's just some chicken runs and uh, very few trees so if i go up you can see that there's less obstruction on this side uh, way way less obstruction okay and we can view here Although I'm not going to cite it here because uh, this is like an open, open space. And uh, let's check. So you see here, it's practically clear. But this is the most impractical place for me to cite. The only obstruction is on the west. Uh, that, those are the bamboo trees here. Anyways, this is just me playing around with this. Um, I'll let you know once uh, the calibration is done on the rooftop sighting I did. And I'll let you know. Alright, thanks for watching guys. Molos, bye.